everyone. I hope you're all doing well. As you may know, Vasaki is just around the corner. And this year it's going to be a bit of a different Vasaki. Uh, I know here in Surrey people are always excited about the Nagakirtan, which is the biggest in the world outside of Punjab. Unfortunately, it's been cancelled this year due to the COVID-19 uh, pandemic. But fret not, I'm here to share with you today 10 ways you can still celebrate Vasaki in your own homes. So without further ado, let's get to it. Step number one, actually celebrate Vasaki. Vasaki is not just any other day. It commemorates the birth of our Khalsa Panth. So when we went from a scattered group of people to one unified nation. Now, I don't know about you, but if my mom were to have her birthday during isolation, I'd still go out of my way to celebrate it within the confines of staying socially distant from people. So when the birth of the Khalsa Panth is in question, why are we not celebrating it? So step one is to actually acknowledge that this is a very special day for a Panth and a cause for celebration. Step two, I know it's a very, very sad time for many Sikhs because we're used to being able to go to the Gurdwara Sahib, especially during festive periods like the Sakhi. However, stay home and do not go to the Gurdwara. By going to the Gurdwara, you're going to be putting other people at risk of spread and we don't want that. However, you can still have Darshan of Guru Maharaj. Uh, no. There are live feeds from Gurdwara Sahibs across Canada and across the world. Uh, if you're here in Surrey, Gurdwara Sahib Dasmesh Darbar does a live feed. I know Guru Nanak Sikh Gurdwara does a live feed. I think Sukh Sagar Gurdwara Sahib also does a live feed. Uh, Google their names on YouTube. Their websites will come up and their live feeds will also come right up. I know Dasmesh Darbar also does a live feed on Facebook. So if you go to their Facebook, you'll probably be able to find that there as well. Step number three, continuing the tradition of Langar. Now, we may not be able to continue the actual tradition of serving food to people like we do during the Nagaketan, but we can still carry on that tenet of Sikhi where we not only feed ourselves but we feed others and there are many different organizations that are doing amazing work right now that deserve your support uh, the first one that comes to mind today the bcspca is actually low on pet food as six we don't just believe that human beings deserve care we believe that care should be extended to all living beings so if you are able to donate pet food to the bcspca that would be very 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 welcomed Another amazing initiative that deserves our donations is virtualvasaki.com. Uh, virtualvasaki.com has been put together by Sevadars across the community uh, to basically take that, um, that theme of donating and sharing our bounty with the community and making it uh, into a virtual kind of uh, plug-in to deal with the current pandemic. This initiative has been put on by a number of organizations that are doing amazing work and I'm going to read them out so I don't forget them. Uh, they are the God Project, One Voice Canada, uh, Sikhi Awareness Foundation International, Kalsa Aid, Guru Nanak's Free Kitchen, South Asian Mental Health Alliance, Sikh Research Institute, Gurdwara Sahib Dasmesh Darbar, Gurdwara Sahib Sukh Sagar, and Seva. So they do amazing work and by donating to virtualvasaki.com you're helping all these amazing uh, community organizations out and you'll be celebrating Vasaki and you're gonna feel good because doing good things feels good. So step number four, uh, listen to English Gata or Gata in Punjabi or any sort of Gata that talks about Khalsa Sajna Devis, that talks about Vasaki, that talks about the importance of this day in our faith. My favorite one is uh, What is Vasaki? Why celebrate Vasaki? I think it's called Why celebrate Vasaki? I'm not sure. But it's done by Nanak Nam. It's amazing. It shakes me to my core every single time I listen to it. It's in English. It's super easy to understand. So make sure you go check that out. Step number five, make sure you feed yourself. It's a festive occasion, so why not celebrate it with some amazing food? I actually have a lot of videos on this channel uh, that talk about how to easily make uh, festival food. The videos are made for Diwali, but the food can easily be made for Vasakhi as well. So make sure you go check out my YouTube channel. The link will appear on the screen. So make sure you check it out, take note of the recipes and make them for your family. 
Step six. I mean, the Nagar Kirtan may be cancelled. We can't go to the Gurdwara, but that doesn't mean we can stop feeling joyful. It's an amazing occasion for us to celebrate. And I think this is the time for us to actually reflect on um, our Sikhi and our heritage. And what a better way to celebrate our heritage than to actually wear it. Uh, I know on Vasakhi on Monday, I'm going to wear my Gurta pajama, even though I'm just gonna sit at home and do nothing probably. But I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna dress up, I'm gonna look good, and I'm gonna feel good doing it, and I'm gonna be celebrating this very special day. So join me, share those pictures on Snapchat, on Instagram, and let's show off our Vasaki looks for 2020 and let's start a hashtag go like hashtag quarantine Vasaki let's do that quarantine Vasaki <laughs> step seven so we have made our donations we have watched our katas gotten into the spirit we've made some delicious food we have changed into our nice clothing now what? Create a Zoom chat, uh, FaceTime your relatives. Today is a perfect opportunity to connect with people you haven't before. Keeping social distancing in mind, isolation has done a number on my mental health. And what's really kept me sane is folks reaching out, uh, me reaching out to people, having those online interactions and um, keeping that human connection going because social distancing doesn't mean we need to be distant socially. So reach out to your relatives, especially the ones who may be living on their own during these times. Holidays are always difficult if you're on your own. Step eight, take inventory of your sikhi. I know that's a bit confusing and what I mean by that is sit down and think about this past year, um, how you've lived your Sikhi out. Um, what have you done? What have been your triumphs? What have been your challenges? And really kind of mind map how you're going to bring yourself closer to Guru Sahib in this coming year. Because Vasakhi is all about renewal, it's all about commitment, it's about rebirth. So why not take this opportunity to take inventory of where we are at right now in our Sikhi and create a plan to make sure that we progress in this year ahead. I know I'll be doing the same and I hope you will as well. Step number nine. What's going to stop us from doing DIY decorations? I mean, like, I don't understand why we don't uh, decorate for Vasaki in our homes. Uh, we do it for Halloween. We do it for Christmas. We do it for Diwali here and there. But why not Vasaki? Uh, I know I shared a bunch of ways that I decorated my house for Diwali. I'm going to be using those same methods to be decorating my house in simple manners for Vasaki, just so the entire house can have that festive ambiance and I don't know about you but I need it uh I am absolutely fed up being cooped up at home I know many other people are as well it's for the betterment of society that we stay home but why make it boring let's make it fun jazz it up and finally step number 10 pray do ardas connect with Gurbani connect with Guru Sahib because at the end of the day we as human beings are nothing on this day, the Panjipyade gave their heads to our Guru. So let's put our heads down to Guru Sahib and say, Hey Satguruji, we are nothing. We are nobody. You are all knowing. You're going to get us out of this mess. We as six believe in the, for the betterment of all people. And uh, we need to act on our own to make sure that happens, but also have faith that we can look up to our guru to ask for that as well. If you're still feeling the Vasaki blues and want to get back into the spirit, I actually uploaded a vlog last year of our entire Vasaki celebrations from the beginning of the month to the end. So make sure you can go check that out on my YouTube channel. This is a golden opportunity for us because we can finally celebrate this day without all the distractions of, oh, that auntie's pushing me. Oh, look at how he's looking at me. We can get rid of all of that internal dialogue and focus on what matters the Khalsa Guru Sahib and helping humanity and with that I'm going to bid you guys farewell hope you guys are doing amazing stay indoors listen to your doctors listen to the health officials and I hope you all have a joyous Vasakhi in this isolation period Wahiguji ka Khalsa Wahiguji ki Fateh have yourselves a good day